My Road to Thailand presents cooking an entire chicken in our air fryer. Stay tuned to see how that plays out. Also, if you watch right to the end of this video, you'll see somebody should have looked in the mirror before recording. All right, so after pat drying this chicken, whole chicken, we are going to be cooking this whole chicken in our brand new air fryer. Uh, this is not the first time we've done it. We did it once before, but I forgot that I wanted to document it. So some of the spices we used were garlic, paprika, chili powder, coriander, salt, pepper, just a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, and uh, mixed it together with a couple tablespoons of olive oil. And I'm going to, after pat drying, I'm going to coat the whole chicken inside and out. And this is the air fryer. This is the one that's replacing our t felt. Um, it's fully digital and it has settings for everything you want to potentially uh, cook in it. We've used it a couple of times and it works pretty good, but this time we're going to show you the results of a whole chicken. Stay tuned for that. One of the things I forgot to mention that I usually say on my videos when cooking something is um, now that it's uh, uh, coated with the spices. Uh, this recipe is pretty much one of our own choosing the spices we want. Recipes are really only a suggestion so just go ahead and do the spices that you prefer to use and I'll let you know how this one turns out. And there it is in the basket. This is a 6.7 liter basket I think it said. I'll uh, get the measurements on that for sure. Okay. Hit the power button. It says on. So now I want to select uh, roast and I want to select start. It says preheat and then it'll once after a minute or two or a couple minutes it's going to say add few food. I don't like to waste energy so I'm putting it in right from the get go. And at 25 minutes I'm going to turn it over. So I'll just leave it at that for now. Yes I was correct. It's a 6.7 liter or 7 quart digital air fryer. Fries with less Fries with air for up to 80% less fat, apparently. Ready, it says add food, and I'm sure that wasn't even uh, two minutes. Okay, so that's 200 degrees for 25 minutes, and then we're going to flip it over. That's the underbelly, and uh, after I've done the flip, now I'm going to coat it with the remainder of the... Uh, spices and put it back in be easier if I had a I do have but too lazy to get it out Actually, it's kind of broken. My camera tripod it doesn't it doesn't stand up very good. That's what happens when you buy something cheap. Here. Okay. There it is, 25 minutes on one side, about 23 on the other side. I checked the internal temperature. It's over 180 degrees. So I'm gonna let it cool while I'm uh, doing some air fryer french fries. See how that plays out. Haven't done french fries in this one yet, so we'll see. This is the only mystery to me. It says, I just put it in, it just says uh, preheat. It's already still hot from taking the chicken out. I didn't clean it, nothing. I just used the, uh, just put it in. Let the oil sitting there that's 
not oil, but I mean the fat from the chicken for the french fries. And uh, I'm going to see how that plays out. I had forgotten to show the french fries before they, when they were done in the air fryer. The air fryer gave them 15 minutes and I think that was just about the right amount of time. A little bit of salt and pepper and they taste pretty good. And ketchup of course. And the chicken is delicious. But Nutch said, next time let's just do salt and pepper. Let's see. I want to check and see if it's good. I haven't tried it yet. No. It tastes good. Really good. I like those seasoning. You don't like it, my love? Hmm? <laughs> I like it. <laughs> but you just want to do salt pepper next time? Yeah. Thanks for watching. If you like this content, it would certainly help with a thumbs up at the least and a subscribe would be even better. Happy Thanksgiving. We're out. Ciao. I think my wife needs new glasses because she thinks my hair looks lovely. I wish I had looked in the mirror before I finished doing the recording. Oh, darn it, man. I need a haircut.